Hello, Mega Crage here, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts 2. In the last episode, we went through this area, uh, found out we can't hurt Hades at the moment, and found this guy. Yeah, that's about it. And before we uh, continue on any further, let me go check if I did something first. And by something, I mean, okay, I did. Okay, so let's uh, backtrack, because everybody loves backtracking, right? I got Heartless all over the underworld now, so you can leave those pipsqueaks to me. <laughs> Look, pal, you just keep working on turning Hercules into a Heartless, then he'll be all mine. This is my underworld, you idiot! I'll handle this myself! Cerberus, go! Backtracking with cutscenes. Oh yeah, so uh, I felt like talking about something randomly just now. I bet everybody's heard about the whole Star Wars getting bought by Disney or all of LucasArts. I'm scared about that, first of all. Uh, cause, um, you know how Disney's all like kid friendly and whatnot? And like watches their you know, I'm gonna stereotype Disney for a second. Yeah, you know, with the whole Cinderella thing. That's what I'm gonna. I'm kind of scared because Lucas and Lucas Arts had full, you know, control over uh, Star Wars, and now since they only have like consent, like they only could like give off like ideas, can't, doesn't have really any control. How is Star Wars Seven gonna hold up? They should have ended the series. They did continue through the books, yes, I know. But they should have ended with six with the movies. It was a good end. It was satisfying. Prequels was I don't the prequels were good. I, I liked them. They're they're not as good as the originals, but I like them, despite of what everyone says. And I'm sorry if I'm a little stuttery, I have a sugar high. Halloween was yesterday, and I am loaded up with candy. Mainly, oh god, okay. Oh god damn, I just wasted a cure, and Donald, god, I hate that. Full swing this condom. Yeah, because that was any better what, than what I was going to say. But yeah, so, it, so we're 7 might be good, might be bad. I'm just kind of scared. So, uh, yeah. That's my opinion. I don't like the fact. Because I'm one of those people who likes companies to be their company. I don't like it them being bought out. I don't like them sharing, like... Like with the whole, uh... Rare thing, like forever ago. I was so mad, because... They were always Nintendo, now they're... Microsoft, and they can't do that, because... I, I find that as, like, being a traitor, I guess you could say. I don't know, I just, it gives me a weird vibe, it gives me like a, I don't like it, type of thing. And you know what, I'm just gonna go ahead and, since I'm done stuttering through that subject, cause I don't, can't, I can't think straight at the moment, let's just get to this cutscene. What? I'm scared! We just got a book! Come on, open! You didn't see that giant lock on the door, really? Will that open it? Yeah, I think so. The key blade, you know, the key to everything. Ah, uh, it might open it. And yes, we are now fighting Cerberus, three-headed dog of the underworld. Um, all you have to really do for him 
Just attack the heads and dodge his moves. Yeah, that's that's, that's about it. <laughs> oh god, he's tearing me up pretty fast. I like to go for the middle head. I don't know why. It makes me... It's the middle. It makes me feel comfortable, I guess. Plus, if you're aiming for the middle, uh, you still attack the side heads anyway because they're in the way. So now you're getting more of the uh, hits in. Okay, I was gonna add an ether, but I guess I'm just gonna... Actually, let me use that ether anyway. Because now I have magic. Kind of. I hate how in this game, Cure takes away all your magic, when in the other game it just takes away some. Like, I, I don't think carrying yourself should take all your power. It's really stupid. I'm really complaining to this episode, god damn. Damn! Yeah, I just got done watching damn TV. It seems like a lot of people are going with the whole uh, internet and or news web show with the whole... I'm gonna talk in front of a green screen with an image right next to me. It, it seems like a lot of people are doing that. Oh my god, oh my god. I am gonna, like... Wait till my magic... Like... Five cakes? Okay. I am not gonna... Hey! Okay. Do you have magic? No. Eh. I'm trying to break this... Okay. Okay, that's not working. Yeah, for those balls... Oh, sh I was gonna say, just keep on run. Oh! First time you're ever gonna see Mickey. I just spoiled it, but... If you click, I won't give up. You, while... Uh, Sora is, you know, resting and regaining his life. You could beat the crap out of the enemies. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Okay, okay. I don't know what this is for. Oh, it's drive. I don't... It doesn't really help in this situation. But yeah, you get to actually play as Mickey, which is pretty cool. And you can even finish off bosses like that. This is really useful in some bosses in the future. I, I usually don't die like this in this boss, or do I? No, yeah, I usually don't. So, I don't know what's my problem today. I'm just very spacey. I'm very, like, there right now. And not, like, glad as an attitude. Because I have a really good attitude. Actually, I have a poor attitude. But I'm, I'm enthusiastic about my poor attitude. That makes sense, right? Yeah. It's hard to explain my feelings. I'm gonna fill this gauge up like a son of a gun. Okay. I'm gonna run away. I'm still gonna run away. Why does Mickey have so much more defense than Sora? This is bullcrap. Why doesn't the main character have a crap load of defense as well as attack? Like, more power to the main character, not to the character that you hardly see. Okay, Mickey, what are you doing? You're just jumping all over the place, and by jumping, I mean flying. That was my phone. Alright, are you gonna... I don't, even, I don't even know what's going on. Just take him out. I just hit a rock with the key. Yeah, at this point, I don't really care because I know there's no way I'm going to die when I become to her again. I don't think you can kill a boss when you're in Mickey form, can you? I, I really don't think so. So, since I can't do that, I'm just going to do this. Yay, magic. Okay, Cerberus, you're dead. Oh, it's, the, it's that whole, you gotta hit him past the uh, damage point thing. Yeah, for these scenes, you can just repeatedly press triangle and you got it. Oh, anyway, we got dodge slash. You get the dodge and you get the slash. That's how that works. And 
and boom. Come on, Wonder Boy, play hooky for a day, for old time's sake. They came to see me. They came to see a hero. I can't let them down. <sighs> Don't worry, Meg. I'll be fine. What does a hero need rest for, huh? <laughs> See ya. <sighs> Huh? What happened to our uh, 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 He can take care of himself. Let's go find Meg. Then we can try this again. So yeah, Aaron left the team. Where did he go? No one knows. Unleash an attack that deals damage to nearby. Oh. Okay. Uh, it unleashes attack that- wait, I have more? Oh, item boost. Effects- Increases effects done by healing items. Whatever. Whatever. Hi, cat. You, you should, like, stop meowing during the video. Because I'm doing a video right now. And, uh, I'm gonna call it quiz for this episode. I know it's a short episode, but I feel like this is a good stopping point. Uh, next episode, we're gonna go up there. To the heavens, and by heavens I mean the Colosseum. So, um, if you liked this episode, thumbs up. If you want to see more from me, subscribe. And um, till next time, Mega Crage. Done now.